What is up, guys? Welcome back to um, Drillmo's Tutorials. It's been some time, and do not complain about my screen. I did this on purpose, so don't even worry about it. Today, we're going to be talking about how to patch any any hack. Because people keep complaining about me saying, Chris, oh, Drillmo, Drillmo, I want a hat. Drillmo, patch this for me, patch this for me. I'm getting sick of it, so I'm going to actually show you guys how to patch any game. First thing we're going to go over is Lunar IPS. Lunar IPS is basically the first thing you got to do. When you get a game, you, you look at this. It, has, it shows IPS and UPS, and UPS, and they also show X Delta, which I have a folder right here. And they show also show X Delta. The only games I know that shows X Delta are D, DS games and um and Pokemon Brown. So I'm gonna use Brown as, basically as an example. First thing I wanna go over is the Lunar IPS. Like I said. Look at the game. If it shows IPS, basically you get the game. Basically, all you gotta do is this: get t click on Lunar IPS. You should you should create log register file. When well, I suggest you guys do this, M make a folder or something, right? This is so you don't have to look look all high low in for the file. Like for example, I'll put like shiny gold here, and I'm gonna grab fire red and put it in here. I'm getting Shiny Gold as an example because um, I'm getting a file that shows the title screen, so I have to like go throughout the entire game, show you how to patch it. Okay, first thing you do is click Apply IP Patch. Make make sure these two things are checked. It makes everything it makes everything work better. Next, next you, you scroll down and you look for the file. You just and you look for where the folder is. Like I said, you make a folder, it makes everything so much easier. So you click you click on this where it shows the patch, right? Then you click on the game, and that's all. That's all you gotta do. For the IP pad. Okay, just to show you guys that it works, I am not naming these because I'm not sitting here all day showing you how to name. It is very slow. Um, desktop. Um, let's see. Mujin, Mujin, here it is. You click it. Oh yeah, I forgot. I use my controller for this. Oh my god, where's my con I, I I forgot I used my controller when I was doing this. Um oh man guys, I'm sorry it's taking me extra time, but I use my controller normally for this stuff. That's why it's See? Shiny gold. Well it's X, but you guys just the idea. See? See, see how easy it is how easy it is for some people it doesn't work so well, lunar IPS it should work for everybody it works for XP Windows Vista 7 and on and on so you guys get the idea you basically oh my god let's click that all you do is click lunar have these two checked on apply patch scroll and it says look for IP patch. You, you click the IP patch right here. Then you click fire red. It we'll, we'll says most common ROM. So you click fire red. And that's all you got to do. That's all you got to do. Alright, so after we done with this, now we got to go to NUPS. NUPS is different. This patch does not work for everybody. So I'm going to actually give you guys a glaze ROM. I'm going to show you guys how you do it. It's basically the same thing as all of them. It says get patch data, but you don't really need this, but you you can do this, though. I, I would suggest it, but I won't really. Like, you just click this, you could check the patch. It doesn't really do much, it just lags your computer. So, it doesn't really lag the computer, it just lags the MPUS. It just shows you, like, the data. I don't really suggest you do this, but it's something. It's just there to be there. If you want to check the data of the check check the data. See? Well, I was gonna close it, but and it tells you like the numbers and everything. Next you go to apply UPS patch. You have to click about abort if this is valid and create backup file with backup. Don't 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 worry about it. All you need is this. Okay, just like I did the last file, let me put it let me put them in the folder, make it easier. Let's put emerald here. And let's put where's glazed. Being glazed because it's like one. It's the only game I know that uses UPS. UPS is usually used for games larger than um thirty, basically larger than sixteen megabytes. It seems. So you click file. Well, you click browse. 
then you look for the file I you know like a file like a folder you made like for your pack for your games. If you guys want to go through high and low look for your files, it's your choice. Basically, files to patch. File to patch. Basically, that means emerald. Because you cl if you click on the first one, it says file to patch. So, it basically means emerald. UPS patch. So, next you click pretty much glaze. Then you click patch. It takes longer than everything else. It says patching has been done. The thing the thing is with the UPS patch, it's uh, more different than the other patches in the... Um, it's different from Lunar and all the rest of them, like I said. For most people, this doesn't work. For most people. It it just doesn't work for any like for like most people. But like I said, I'm gonna send everybody the thing. See? Blazed. Alright. And now we're now we're duck now we're up to the la the last to the last one. There's probably more patching, but all I know is these three. Alright. Next time we get to um, X Delta. Thing is, I hate X Delta GUI and the rest of them, so I use X Delta UI. I'm gonna give you guys download links to the ones I'm using. So I use X Delta UI. It's much better. It actually works. So basically, first thing you do is click patch. You click open. And it says patch, right? You click on brown. I got put my brown as an example. It works for like you know Nintendo DS games too, like you know Blaze Black, Vault White. Um, expert, uh, expert emerald, um, platinum origins, bloody platinum. You guys get the idea. You click this, then you click source file. The source file is basically the GB, basically the ROM. So you click, you look for the the, the basic source file is ROM. Patch is patch. Then you click, then you click this. Then it says output file. I prefer this because it, because it actually makes the file yourself. Then you do this, and you get file name. Basically, you put any name you want. But if you when you're doing this, you have to like put a name, like put like this. Basically, it's GBA or NDS. But put, put like this. You do like this. Put like a random name. I don't care. You can put like the name of the game. But I'm lazy, so I'm just do this. Like I put this. Type in GB. GB. Basically, it's GB for GB, like GB, like GB for like, you know Game Boy. And if it's DS, if you're patching in like an NDS file, basically a DS game, then it's gonna be typed into the NDS. Basically, you cop basically you can copy and paste the NDS. I might be saying this wrong because you know NES, yeah, NDS is NES, NDS is Nintendo DS. Yeah, I'm right. And basically, GB is for GB G, Game Boy, NDS, and you see no, Nintendo DS. And you click save and patch. If you do not type GBA, the game will not work. I, I should have showed you guys that it doesn't work. Basically, you click Game Boy. Do this. Okay, that's not supposed to happen. What the fuck? Oh, <laughs> I just noticed I um, I had it in, in another folder. Let me just drag it out of here, make it easier for me. And then you click Game Boy, Mujin, and oops. There you go. See, I thought you passed the three known, the three known um things I know. Due to I said NUPS does not work for everybody, I will send you guys um glaze. I don't know any other games that use NUPS. So if you message me, basically put in the comments, you know, on the comment section, and tell me what games use the NUPS, and I will like send you guys the actual, the actual ROM because it does not work for everybody. I will not send you Lunar or X Delta. You guys do that yourself because X Delta works for everybody. Lunar works for everybody too. I will send you guys like the, the download links for the Lunar and X Delta and the NUPS. All right. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any comments of any like tutorials I should do next, like any game you want me to do a tutorial, next thing you want me to do a tutorial on, or you know. Or like you know, like do a review of a, like do a review on something or a rant on something. Sacks and I'll and I'll and I'll do I'll see what I can do. So thank you guys for watching. Oops. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you and goodbye.